A carpet of horse manure covers the streets of Santana de Livramento, a Brazilian border town. This town of only 80,000 people organized a parade with over 3,000 horses. That's not easy to do anywhere. It could be the biggest horse festival in the world. Despite being a border town, Santana is very modern. I happen to be in town for the local Farupila festival, a celebration of the national spirit. It's a festival for the gauchos of Rio Grande do Sul to commemorate their ancestors and promote national culture. Before the festival, I followed a team of 35 people to another city more than 300 kilometers away to fetch the flame. It's a tradition not unlike the torch relay before an Olympic Games. Despite living in an area of automobiles and airplanes, they spent 40 days riding horses along the same muddy dirt roads their ancestors once traveled on. The riders did almost everything during the journey. They took care of the horses, chopped firewood, and barbecued meat. The flavors of feyota, a stew made of beans with beef and pork invented by black slaves, remained unchanged to this day. They played old games and sang around the campfire. It was a simple and joyful life, just like in the old days. The flame they brought back lit the torches and lamps of all the 25 horse teams in the town. These old objects were handed down from their ancestors and carry many memories. They also follow the tradition of strengthening bonds between riders with a handshake while on horseback. The bright torches and lamps symbolize the culture and traditions of the gauchos living forever. <laughs> 